And to me, an old git, I mean, still got a novelty to it, hasn't it? I'm really sorry about him. Oh, it's fair enough to say that. It's not like you disapprove of it, is it, Mr. Brandon? No, of course not, love. No, it's the age thing. You know, that, that gets me more. What are you talking she about? She's that much younger than him. He's oh, always saying not, stuff like that. Yeah, you might better answer this. Why do black blokes go for white birds? Maybe because they fancy them? <laughs> oh, I suppose so. Yeah, yeah. I'm well, just generalising here, but to uh, be fair. You don't see too many white blokes with blackbirds, do you? Brandon. Maybe you're just seeing what you don't like. You notice it more. No, no, it's just an observation, see? I mean, to me, love is love. I see no colour, me. You're having a laugh, aren't you? The amount of grief you gave Mum and Ellen when they first got together. Oh, well, she was my little girl, wasn't she? Oh, so a black man ain't good enough for your little girl? No man's good enough for my little girl. You ask any dad. No, but I've got to put my hands up. I mean, that Ellen, he turned out to be a good lad in the end. Uh, and I must say... I learned a lot about my prejudices during that, and now I like to think of myself as a citizen of the global village. Oh, Where'd you get that load of cobblers from? Off a box of tea bags. Oi, you, lowlife. What do you think you're doing dressing my daughter up as a tart? Use yourself as inspiration, did you? Leave her alone. Or what? Or I'll make you feel even smaller than you already are. Come on, Johnny. Why don't you get yourself out, mate? 